Right, hope you're all well. So today's gonna to be a bit of a different video. Uh, what I'm gonna be doing is, we're working away and we've got a rewire, so we're gonna do a little review on the Ferret. We've got the Ferret, what's this one? The Ferret Plus wireless inspection camera, and then all the little goodies, like the accessories. And we're gonna be doing, doing an honest review on this today um, because we're doing a rewire and it's gonna come in super handy as it's raised floors. So. What you do is you cut the floorboards off and then you've got a big cavity of how big do you reckon this? About a metre? Uh, no, I'd say two, two foot. Two foot. Yeah. You only get a crawling, so you don't need a camera. <laughs> so uh, yeah, we're gonna give this a go and there's some cool features on here like the I'm pretty sure, yeah, the non cap contact voltage detector. So currently the house we've had to leave part of it on as we need to keep power to the freezers and stuff. As it's a rewire, they've moved out but they've still got a bits and bobs there. So we need to keep some part of the power on safely. So we'll show you the cool non-contact voltage indicator where like you push it up to a cable and it shows it's live. A bit like the little woo-woo pens. Woo-woo pen. Woo-woo pens. But yeah, so I thought I'd do a little unboxing here. Um, this is where we're staying, we've got like an Airbnb, which is really, really nice. cool. Bought the Xboxes, so keeping ourselves entertained. But right, let's start with this one. So we've got, this is the case, I think, for the camera. I have had this out and charged the camera up prior to this, ready for today, so we can get some footage. So as soon as you open this up, we've got this side, which is all the little accessories, and then this side, which is the camera. So this is the camera. It's got a nice black and gold two-tone color into it. And then some lights in there, you can see straight away in the camera lens. And I think if you unscrew this end cap, that's where you charge it and turn it on. So, like I said before, this is a wireless camera, so to connect this, you connect it to your phone, just like smartphone or iPad. We sometimes use the iPad as it's quite good, it's a bigger screen. And you can record off that so you can show customers, say if you're doing, I don't know, like you're a damp person, like you're checking the floors for damp, you can record it and then show the customer what you're talking about, what you found. So that's the camera. The attachments, there's loads in here. You've got like this one, the bendy flexible one. You've got all the different accessories to attach them to your rods, like a flexible rod attachment. You've got a hook so you can pull cables through. We found this one as well, which is you can tie a cable through it, like the copper, and then pull on a cable. And then next, moving us on, we've got the selfie stick. So this is, uh, no, it's not a selfie stick. I just, it just looks like a selfie stick. <laughs> so you can, well, kind of it is a selfie stick, isn't it? Because you put your camera yeah. on the end of it. Yeah, it's extendable, a telescopic pole. Yeah, that's it. Or you can just put the... Mom, it? <laughs> <laughs> or you can just put the hook on and then just use it to grab things. Right, so that one's covered. And then this is just the box that came in, so it tells you all the key features. So built-in Wi-Fi, so you connect. It's not Bluetooth, you just connect through the Wi-Fi. It's all HD, Zoom. You've got, you've got loads of things here, but it's all the new features on this one. So I think this is the best one. There's three different ranges. You've got a plus, and there's two other ones. I can't remember the names of them. And they're all priced differently, but then each one has different um, what you call it, options, so and more, more available. So this one is obviously the better one, so it has all the options available, like fast charging, built-in memory, the non-contact voltage indicator. And then finally, we've got the ferret wristband. So this is, it just goes on your wristband like around your arm there and then your phone will clasp into that and you can watch your live feed from the ferret directly whilst you're using your other hand to fish it around under the floor. What I'm going to do now is we'll jump to the job and get some action using this. Right, we're at the job now. Nick's went to McDonald's. We went to McDonald's and yeah. I got something. Wow, what did you get? Yeah, so this is the job. I'll see. Been around, chased all in. Nick's done wonders using the metabo so we've got a lot of data points here so this job is literally for re rewire like i said before so there's loads of stuff to do so i've been kind of too busy getting stuff from my portfolio from my college yeah. and not really filming for you guys as you'll see it on nick's channel and also on rick the uk spark who came yesterday to give us a hand so shout out to him but yeah, Nick's just got the rods out, so obviously that's going to come in hand, handy with the ferret. I've just put the little, what's this called, the wristband on, so I can connect my phone into Your that, and then watch what's happening under the floor. Well, I've got a big one on. 
<laughs> yeah, so what I'll do is, from now, now we're at the job, I'll insert a few little screen recordings or the recordings from the ferret of using the ferret in action under the floor, showing its actual use and purpose. So let's have it. Yeah, we're gonna go, before you start recording, Deuce board's gonna be under the stairs where it currently is. It's all raised floor, so we're gonna try and get across from that little hatch we've made there, across to this one. So down here. This one, across to that one, that across one, to that there. one, and back over there, and then to there, and then to back, and then to that one, to that one, and that's, that's our day, mate. Go yep. home, have a few beers, play in Call of Duty, done. Have a cuddle, maybe. Another little thing to add is I've just unscrewed the end cap, turned the ferret on, so obviously the lights up, come on when it's on. And then you download the app from the app store, which is just called Ferret, and you see that little, the, obviously the logo, which is the ferret. Download it, very fast download, it's not very big, I think it's just a few little meg. And then when you do that, go on, if you've got an iPhone or Android, just go on settings, go on Wi-Fi, click the Wi-Fi for ferret, and then go back on the app and it will automatically connect and then i'll show you the screen now what it pops up with right so this is a little clip nick's had to record it on his phone as trying to record on this then connect to the ferret doesn't work so what i'm showing off is the non-contact voltage indicator so obviously when you come close using the end to a live cable it indicates that it's live with a buzzing noise and it all turns red on here so light switch obviously this is on Right, so as you can see, I've screwed it on the rod, there, and obviously we're connected on my phone, so we're gonna go under the floor now with a ferret. Uh, yeah, keep using mobile data. You're gonna know, screen record as well, yeah? Uh, yeah, I'll start recording on here, so I think you just click that button there. Yeah, so now we're recording, nice. so it's saving. Right, so I'll throw it over to Nick now, so Nick's obviously gone in that stair covers, and I'll throw it to him under the floor. Uh, let me just grab this. Two. Could put it on the wristband, but it's quite hard to film the wristband, so you guys can see. So if I put that, if I put that there, we can both see it. Right, should be coming. Right, the lights are nice and bright now. Put that there, we can both see it. Right, should be coming. He's You've just seen on the clips before of the ferret Nick throwing it to me as it was easier to do it that way. And we've caught it, so. You can pull it up, mate. I've got another rod on. Pull it up, yeah. So yeah, yeah. you can see the light in action there. Let's grab it. Pull it up. Yep. And I'll unscrew the ferret. And Right, so we've done a few. We've done this one to that, to the main fuse board, and we've done a few in the other rooms. So far, really handy. It's very good with all the different attachments that attach onto the rods, but the other features that we want to review are like the battery life and stuff like that, which is something you review over time as I've only charged it up once last night and we're only using it bits and bobs throughout jobs. So it, it would probably last ages for me, months, because I only use it every now and then, not like an everyday type of tool for me as an electrician. So that I'll give a re review in another video um, in a couple of weeks. Once we've used it a bit more.